goodness. All right, Katie, here at home, we have our own concerns about weather. Yes, a very substantial storm system starting to take shape. The pieces of the puzzle are absolutely coming together, and now the outlook is becoming much more concrete. But there is a lot of complexity with this, which means there's a lot of detail to cover. So listen up. You know, if this is a very location based forecast, moisture beginning to lift in as we speak, but the rain will wait for our area until this afternoon. So you're going to get through the morning drive without any weather related problems, and now's a good time to prepare for the upcoming rain and wind that's going to hit us. I would secure loose objects that are on the porch in the backyard. We've had nice weather lately. You might have been out and had some things outside with you to enjoy that weather. Make sure that they are packed away or secure. A coastal flood advisory. Let's turn our focus to the shore. That goes into effect tomorrow morning for a couple of different high tide cycles in tandem with this storm system. And we also have a full moon coinciding with this. So that's going to lead to some flooding, coastal flooding and erosion, no less, along the coast through this event and even beyond that point. That's why the, the flood advisory lasts so long into the weekend. Heavy rain with the storm at the shore, one to two inches easily, gusts up to 60 miles per hour, and that high wind watch, that's everywhere. That's not exclusive to the shore. Everybody's in on that. So everybody, as a result, is also going to see the possibility of downed trees or even some minor power outages. Again, not exclusive to the shore on that one. Meanwhile, the best chance for snow absolutely goes to the mountains. Great news if you're a ski lover, but you are easily going to be seeing about five or more inches, and some models are trying to double that. It just depends how hard that snow thumps as it gets in there. But a sharp cut off the further south you go, I wouldn't worry so much about the snow here in the city. This is rain and wind for us, and it's an all-day Friday event. By the weekend, the storm is still nearby, Misha, so there's still a breeze, but at least we're starting to dry out by then.